Good afternoon and welcome to our KRQE.com webcast. I'm Deanna Saucedo. We begin with meteorologist John Smith in the forecast. Hi, John. Hi, Deanna. It's going to be a nice afternoon with mild conditions and mostly sunny skies, especially for the central and southern portion of the state. But tonight we're looking for another backdoor cold front to drop into the eastern plains, and that will cool things down for midweek. But it will be a dry front, so we're not expecting any precipitation with this. After high pressure and control for much of the week, we're looking for our next storm system to push into our direction. And as that happens, we're looking for wind on the front end of the system for Thursday, then on the back end of the system for Friday and into the weekend. We're looking for a good dose of rain and snow for Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, as well as some of the coolest weather we've seen all season. Thanks a lot, John. Police say it was a drug deal gone bad. A 14-year-old boy wanted to score some marijuana for his friends, so they called 19-year-old Jonathan Escobar, according to police. Police say he's a drug dealer. Escobar picked up the two teens at a UNM dorm where the 14-year-old's friend lives, but the friend took Escobar's pot and took off. Police say Escobar then held a gun to the 14-year-old's head and told him he would have to pay for the stolen drugs. The teen told Escobar that he could get the money from his mom, who lived on Kirtland Air Force Base. When they got to the base, the teen told the guards he was kidnapped, and Escobar was then arrested. It's not a one-size-fits-all for a Deming family accused of gun running. Federal judge ruled that one attorney cannot represent the entire family. Undercover agents busted four members of the Reese family for allegedly selling guns and ammunition to Mexican cartel members. They own the New Deal shooting store in Deming and have requested that Albuquerque attorney Sam Bregman represent them all. But the judge says that would pose a conflict of interest. Stay with KRQE for more news and weather updates. Have a great Monday, everybody. See you tomorrow.